So the first thing you'll need to do is uh, install Picasa and once it finds all of the photos in your computer you'll have them listed on the side. When you have some you need to upload you can select those. Uh, I clicked, hit shift and clicked again to select uh, a, a group of them. You can do uh, entire albums at one time or just a few from an album. Then go down and hit upload and at that point you can just leave it in whatever album it's called or if you'd like to call it something different um, you can call it whatever you need to there um, generally uh, I make things public that helps uh, with viewing particularly when you're going to embed it in a website and usually on the side 600 pixels is plenty big enough for just about anything you could probably make them smaller but this will make it big enough for people to print if they want them later then you can just go ahead and upload and you'll see that that's then uploading to your Picasa uh, storage online. So once we get there, almost done, it will give you the option of going there to view online. You can see I can view the Chinese art section online or this and it will take us right to your Picasa web album that you have just uploaded. Now let's take a look. I have in my photos, I have three albums that I have uploaded. Uh, the first thing that you're going to want to know how to do is organize. Uh, let's say I wanted this particular image. I could then move that or copy that to another album and we're going to do copy. So um, call it whatever you need to and public on the web and I want to choose uh, details for new album oh details for new album for example this is uh, there we go for the slideshow and public on the web up we go there's one I'm going back to my photos I'm going to go to a different album and I'm going to pick this. I'm going to copy that to another album, except I'm going to an existing album. I'm going to put that on for slideshow. Select the album. So once you have the album, it's easier to go add them in. Now, what I'm not necessarily seeing is an easy way to select a bunch at a time. I don't think that's going to work. Um, nope. So we'll just do one at a time. Copy to another album. It's not horrible. Choose an existing album for slideshow, select the album. And off we go. So you can make your collection this way. Now, once you have that album, or any of the albums, you then need to create the slideshow you're going to embed in the website. If you then go over to the side and see link to this album, link to this album, then go to embed slideshow. So you want to make sure that you're linking to that album and then embedding the slideshow. And this is the embed code that you want. Now, make sure you pick the appropriate size for the space that you have. Medium is pretty small, so if you're in a sidebar that might work out really well. Actually, you might need the small for the sidebar if you're putting it in the navigation bar. Um, if you want it to fill a page, then the larger the extra large uh, probably would be good. So we'll just do a small one. And do that. And then we're then you want to copy this because it includes in it that's 144 pixels. You can see here that this is your width and height. If you need to change the width or height at any point, that's uh, what you're dealing with. You can just type in numbers there, but make sure it's relative uh, to the dimensions that you need for your slideshow. So, copying, and done. Now you have an embed code you can paste in any HTML for any website. If you're just embedding it in a Google site, it's really easy. You just go insert um, Picasso slideshow, and you can pick the album you want it to go from. So, that should be pretty straightforward. If you have any questions, holler. If you're not sure how to then get it into the website, let me know. Um, that may be an issue for... Uh, whoever keeps the website up and does the HTML uh, sort of back-end stuff or what program they're using for that. Um, but it should be relatively straightforward. Hope that helps.